What's up everybody, CJ the Beast here, and you already know I'm back at it with another UFC video for you all. As you all know, UFC 202 is tonight. We're gonna get into a couple breakdowns of what I think is gonna happen. By the way, new concept, we're walking and talking, you know. Uh, gives us a little, you know, get active. So what's up? Everybody knows about the main event, Conor McGregor versus Nate Diaz. Honestly, the first fight around, I feel like Connor wasn't prepared enough because I mean you gotta you guys gotta remember he had like what 10 days to gain like fucking 10 15 pounds like come on ain't nobody gonna be conditioned if they're gaining 10 15 pounds like I mean but for the most part he was doing his thing for the first eight minutes of the fight I mean he did get sluggish at the end and he made some mistakes like that was his fault though, you know? He, he owned up to it, he said it was his fault. And you know, I respect him because he, he didn't want to just go away and let this, this loss linger over him, you know? He was like, all right, I'm gonna fucking ask for this rematch because this is the fight I want. I want to redeem myself. And I respect that a lot. Now that he has a full training camp, I, I say Connor takes this one. By what manner? I don't really know. Honestly, I feel like it's going to go to a decision because if y'all know the, the Diaz brothers, the motherfuckers ain't known to just get really knocked out like that. This one, pff, fucking easy. Anthony Johnson versus Glover Teixeira. I mean, Anthony Johnson, since he lost that uh, championship fight, guy's been on a tear. He's not, he's not letting anybody get him. He's fucking, you already know he was heavy hitting before. Now this nigga's knocking out souls. He's... And I'm gonna say, I, I see Glover Teixeira get knocked out. I'd say the second round. I can see, I can see that going to the second round. I believe if if Anthony Johnson wins this one, I think he should definitely get a title shot next because he definitely deserves it. Rick Story versus Donald Cerrone. I really don't know who Rick Story is, but Donald Cerrone, Cerrone and Cerrone, which are, yeah, I don't know what fuck be trying to correct you. Y'all y'all gonna put it in the comment. It's Cerrone, sir. Pronounce it right. No, nah, no, 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 mess it up. But you already know. Uh I see this is at a welterweight fight. I I I'm not gonna lie. His last fight at welterweight, he actually did fairly amazing. Is he switching weight classes? I don't know. Should he? I feel like he could really make some noise in the the welterweight. But I, I definitely have Donald Cerrone winning this one. Which way? I really don't know. Donald Cerrone's pretty versatile. He could fucking choke you out, knock you out, just beat you for three fucking rounds. You know, the guy's real good. I say, you know what? I give him the, I give him a repeat of his last fight. I say he knocks this guy out. In what round? Not really sure. But I'm rocking with Cerrone on this one. Mike Perry versus. Oh, y'all gonna roast me for this one. Uh, how the fuck do you put Hun Jun Lim? Uh, some, some very oriental name. Oriental, politically correct. Ain't racist over here. Uh, I can't really pronounce it. I really don't know both these fighters. But I say, from the looks of it, Mike Perry's undefeated, so. Just because I like to see people go undefeated, you know, because I am a John Jones fan. But y'all are no different. The one time I was wearing a John Jones shirt in that one video, and I was just like, yo, John Jones all day. But that, that ain't the point right now. So I'm going to go with Mike Perry because, you know, I just don't want him to get defeated. You feel me? You stay undefeated, you know, be, be real with yourself. Cody Garbrandt versus Takeya Mizugaki. You know what, I don't even I don't even really know about this one. Mizugaki's good, but Cody's been on the tag. He's, he's undefeated too. So you know, I gotta go with undefeated. So hopefully he's 10 and 0 after this fight. So I'm gonna go with Cody Garbrandt. Raquel Pennington versus Elizabeth Phillips. This is a bantamweight women's fight. I'm gonna go with Pennington. I think this is a prelim fight. Ooh, this one's interesting. Neil Magny, or, yeah, no, it's Neil Magny, versus Lorenz Larkin. 
I'm gonna be honest, I have not seen any of these brothers fight, but I'm gonna have to go with Neo Magni. He, he just seems like such a, such a fucking good fighter. Like I, I usually see his highlights. I never see, I never watch like a full fight. And he, he does, he does real good work. That's pretty much all the fight. That's not all the fights, but I gave my opinion on most of the fights that's going down. So I feel like it's going to be a real good night. I, I think we're going to see some very eventful stuff. We're going to see, we're, we're going to see a lot of good shit happening. You know, fuck man. I really hope Conor McGregor wins though. I'm not going to say I'm a Conor super fan because I'm a fan of Conor and Nate Diaz, but you know. I, I, I love trilogies. I love trilogies. So I really want fucking Connor to win this one. And then, you know, maybe a year or two from now, they go for that third, which would be very good. All right. So thank you for taking this walk with me. Appreciate you guys. Watch UFC 202 tonight. This ain't sponsored. What's up? Tomorrow shoot. Oh, for real? Yeah. Oh, so you shoot. Yeah. So this is going in. Yeah. Oh, shit. Thank you all for watching the video. CJ the Beast here, you know. Had to release a little content. I know I've been gone for a little bit, been sick, been dealing with other stuff, you know, I got life stuff and school stuff and all that stuff, but you know, I'm back to making videos and hopefully I'll get out like two videos a week, hopefully. Bear with me now, you know, life is tough. Oh, by the way, check out my gaming channel that I made with my friends, uh, Yanegi and Exocat, and also check out our BRE channel which has, you know, a couple skits we come up with on weekly basis. So we're probably going to be dropping weekly skits, you know, when we get when we get stuff going a little more. We're going to do challenges on BRG and all that stuff. And, you know, what else? What else? What else? What else? What else? Uh, shoot. What's that? What's that other stuff? What's, what's that other thing? What's that other thing? Oh, by the way, for all of you that don't know, I'll, I do have other channels, so... To make it easier on you all, I made a playlist that says Stuff I'm In. So just in case you're not subscribed to those channels, you can just watch it from here. You know, leave a like, share it around, you know, it helps out a lot. Appreciate it. Holla at your boy. This is a Ryan Little production.